Well, hello everyone. This is Tony, and I wanted to give you a little bit of update about uh, Tony's subscriber mashup, which I promised last week. That has been going really well, folks. Thank you for sending me the videos. I am planning on Thursday night, uh, hopefully going forward, if, if I keep getting submissions from people, every Thursday night I'll be putting out a mashup. So this coming Thursday is April the 10th. Uh, I would imagine I'll probably post this around 9 o'clock or something, uh, Eastern Standard Time in America. And so I've been getting some submissions from all over the world. Some of my friends, particularly over in the UK and other places, I've, I've gotten some really cool little videos. Uh, some of them are heartwarming, warming, some of them are funny, some of them are kind of mind-blowing. Uh, some of them are maybe standard run-of-the-mill at first you might think and then there might be a few little tricks and and, uh, and weirdnesses that work their way in there so i'm really really looking forward to sharing that with you i also want to give you a little update about what's getting ready to happen with my channel um going into springtime i do a lot of gardening videos so those of you who are here to watch me do uh, tech videos be patient with me i, I still will do gopro videos i'll still do software um you know tutorials and things like that i realize that's still a lot of the people that watch me but i also like to do a lot of gardening videos and we have asparagus coming up that's like huge now my wife just called me and told me that the, the latest spring rains that we've had here we've been out of town for a few days have made these uh, nice shoots of asparagus come up it's the first time i've been able to eat asparagus out of my garden because i've been letting it get established so there's going to be some excitement for me in my little garden so you'll see some of that shot some uh, family video with uh, nikki's uncle paul who is it turns out i had no idea i heard that he grew grapes and i'm trying to grow grapes i have seven little puny vines right now but uncle paul it turns out is a grape growing machine he has hundreds of vines that he's put up it's just, just awesomely and nikki's been trying to tell me to go visit him over the years and he's a different kind of guy but totally cool and sweet and amazing uh, grapevines down in Indian country, down in Pembroke, North Carolina, on the coastal plain NC. So you're going to see me sharing some family growing videos, some gardening videos. Hope you don't mind that. There will be, as always, a mishmash of other videos and things going out there too. Travel, driving, tech, uh, software, reviews, opinion, and stuff like that. I want to throw out one cool thing that happened to me today. I was not expecting it. I was coming out of one of my favorite Mexican restaurants, and someone uh, said, Tony, Tony Lee Glenn, is that you? And this kind of blew my mind. I didn't know what that was. Very few people call me Tony Lee Glenn. Uh, the reason I, I go by Tony Glenn here locally in Morganton, uh, it turned out there was like a serial killer or something like that, some kind of a criminal uh, way out west named Tony Glenn that was on there. So I started using the Lee in the middle of my name, which I always sort of used Lee when I played music because, you know, Stevie Ray Vaughan, Jerry Lee Lewis, uh, you know, the, 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 it seemed like three three um, name personas is what works well in music. So I kind of always went, went with the Tony Lee Glenn when I played music. So I adopted that for my YouTube channel. But it was odd to hear Tony Lee Glenn called out as I'm coming out of my restaurant. I turn around to see who it is, and it turns out it was this guy named Chris and his wife, Renisa. I think I have got her name right. And Chris and Renisa had two beautiful kids. And they explained to me that they had seen my videos online and that they were, it was driving videos in Morganton, North Carolina, and that Chris had been looking at a job in Morganton. And what, by watching my videos, he had made the decision to go ahead and take the jump, the leap, and move to Morganton and live. And I think that's awesome. That really blew my mind. It was the first time I felt like, I mean, <laughs> I shudder to say it, but almost like a little bit of a YouTube personality. It was just odd. It was odd to be recognized from a YouTube video by people who don't know me. So, cool. I got to meet some people who actually made a life decision to come to Morganton, which is a great place to live. Western North Carolina is awesome. They're not going to regret that decision, I'm sure. Uh, but in part, they seem to have made their decision by watching videos. And so Chris had taken a job here, and they all seemed very happy. And I told them they were going into an awesome uh, Mexican restaurant, El Portal, uh, near Walmart, if you're ever in the uh, Morganton area. It's my favorite Mexican restaurant. Go try that out. Last thing I'm going to say before this little video update ends is that I will be doing a TED Talk. The TEDx Hickory um, is coming up in May. 
And so those of you who don't know what a TED Talk is, go check it out. Look up TED, T-E-D, Technology, I can't remember what it stands for, Design, Technology Entertainment Design, I think is what TED stands for. So I'm going to be doing the TEDx, and I'll be talking on a, a topic about life enrichment through YouTube video blogging. And I'm going to talk about my whole little experiment doing this whole YouTube thing. So, folks, I'm running up on six minutes here. I don't want to take up any more of your time. Uh, I probably will be posting some of my TED Talk on here and, um, you know, just testing it out on you guys so that when I go do the TED Talk, uh, I will say something hopefully meaningful that promotes YouTube video blogging and how it can make your life kind of cool. And so watch those videos and please do critique those videos. If you see them... Uh, it would mean a lot to me to get some input from you, what you think about my practice videos I'm putting out there. I'm putting them out for my TED coach. You have actually a TED coach that uh, kind of guides you through your first TED talk. So you're going to find some of those out there. If you're thinking, what in the world's Tony doing? It's like morally safer trying to do some commenta commentary on 60 Minutes. That's what that's about, and I will label those things TED Talk. So folks, Thursday night... Be sure to check out uh, the YouTube channel, and we are going to do that mashup of uh, subscriber videos, and all those will have links back to the full videos you get to enjoy. They're really some pretty cool videos. Y'all, peace. Thanks. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. I uh, just wanted to give you that little heads up so you don't think Tony's getting off into some weird uh, terrain here with the YouTube channel. Y'all come back, leave any comments, and subscribe if you like.